Marion Bay. What are you doing guys? Uh, FG not mate. The one uh, we just lost a tuna. It's my knot tie. The knot failed and the lure and the fish went. The lady there.
Yeah, you got there, mate. Nice puffer. This looks like a whiting. We haven't seen one of them in a while. I know when to grab the camera out. Paddy Cat's in the rocky. Real cool. Hey! <laughs> Well, out here, mate. Out here in the rain, all by yourself, mate. What do you got there? Corker? Look at that thing, mate. Hey? Look at that, mate. 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 Put a towel down so it doesn't slip. And everyone has their different ways, eh? Put the scars off. Well, I like to come in here, here, and then you just turn your knife around the front, and then off with it. Follow the bone, backbone all the way through, all the way through, you know, all straight through. Bang. And this one, same thing, in like that. Turn, bring your knife forward, and then just follow the bone. On. And boom. Sharp, sharp knife. Real sharp knife. Yeah, Left with a pretty hollow frame, but we'll take that off, mate. Oh yeah. Maybe. I'll put it with the Mackie. Now we're gonna nice. get the car, now we're gonna get the rim cage out. So the easiest thing is to come in with your knife. As soon as you go past there, you lay it out flat and you just come out like that. And you should be able to just pick that up. And then go like that. And it's, repeat the process, but it's a bit different on this one because you've laid it out. So I like to lay in first, hand over top. How big was this widening? Over 40. The smaller ones just as easy to do? Smaller ones? Yeah. Oh, sort of. Sometimes the easy, bigger ones are easy because you've got more to grab onto. But once you get the knack for it, they're all just. Yeah, I get to that too. It's easy to grab hold on those. Yeah. Big. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's joking. Saw it joking there, wasn't it? Could have been. Something for everyone in there. Yeah. Yeah. Take what Make you sure. want from it. Yeah. Take that out. You can just see that little row of bones there from the fins. That's out. Done. See, so, uh, Marion Bay's turned the weather on for us today. Yeah, it's the notorious weedy whiting. Yeah. Hey, no little crumpet joke there. Squid. That's a, that's a decent bloody squid. We've obviously taken this bit of bait here. Not much technical there. That's one. And the little bait there. That's it. They were yeah, two together, and we thought, oh yeah, we're onto a patch of these, and it was just a two of them. Get into those flaps, mate. Ten fingers. Yeah, he loves it. Oh, look at that. Got away on you, mate. Throw it back in. Today's Sunday. Second last day of the trip. 
and the weather's turned it on for us again. I do, but I'll have to charge. Yeah. Right, right capping cool. Oh yeah, there's some rollers coming in now, mate. Yeah. No fishing today, just uh like mixed yeah. grill lunch. Yeah, watching down here man there's one same one one of the little coves just outside of Marion Bay too windy to go fishing today hopefully tomorrow morning it's good because we've got to come home tomorrow so see how we go eh Today is Monday, the 30th of January. Uh, our last day fishing, but the wind is absolutely terrible. So, packing up and going home. No tuna once again. But we did catch one and lost it due to bad not tying. Um, so we've learned how to do that properly, so the trip has not been a waste whatsoever so we've learnt some valuable information and um, we're pretty confident next time the knots will hold we tested everything um, not wise before putting the lures back in the water so lesson learned all packed up ready to go we're gonna head back to our drossen wash your boat there because Marion Bay there's no boat cleaning facilities here that's for sure there's no mains water so it's all rainwater tanks so stayed reasonably clean as I coated it with some waka wax before um, we went out just to help stop the salt from sticking um, yeah so we'll head off there and have a claim. Boat's all clean, job done. Here at the Ardrossel boat ramp. Shouldn't have brought a black boat. Look nice, but it's so hard to keep clean. 